Hello everyone, welcome to a new episode of Paper Mario, The Origami King. Last time we left off, we made it here to Autumn Mountain and heard its beautiful, beautiful music. And I kind of rushed past this whole, like, field of tall grass to get to, uh, a save point, but we're gonna explore it this time. Wayside Water of Elemental Shrine. All offerings are appreciated, damp offerings preferred. Um... Damp offerings, huh? I forgot to mute the TV. There we go. Damp offerings. Uh... I don't have any of those. Hello, I can't help but see that I can get over here, though. Hi. Ooh, a fire flower. Oh, and someone in the comments did tell me uh, a couple of things, actually. Uh, if I had finished off the colored pencils boss with the thousand folds, uh, I would have gotten a special kind of finishing move, which sounds pretty cool, so I'll keep that in mind for any future boss fights. Um, also that... The, uh, Fire Flower does indeed have action commands, the game just doesn't tell you that for some reason. So I'll keep that in mind as well, and... Also, I mentioned last time, uh... Wishing that I could switch my weapons in the middle of a fight, and apparently you can do that. So, uh, I'll keep that in mind as well. I'm just kinda... Searching around this area to see if there's possibly anything hidden, like this. Oh, there you are. Friendship Plaza. Please pick up your energy cans to facilitate maximum friendship. Okay. So, you're waiting for your best buds, huh? Same here. Having buddies is pretty cool so far. I definitely recommend it. Bobby, what are you doing? Don't tell me you got lost in that tall grass. Big M, ma'am. I knew you'd find me sooner or later. Reuniting with your buds is pretty cool, too. I definitely recommend it. Oh, you met up with your amigos. That's the best. Let's have ourselves a super duper canned food party to celebrate. Shy oh my. A canned food party? That does sound like fun. Wait, no, no, no. We have to go see the water elemental. Come on, Bobby. Say goodbye to your, uh, new friend. You got it, ma'am. Let's mosey. All right, Bobby. Smack, smack. Well, he was fairly easy to find, I will say. Hmm, so refreshing. Nothing better than mountain air. I wonder if the air here is even if the even the air here is red. It looks clear, but you never know. This world is so big, Big M, but I understand so little of it. Ugh. All right, let's go, buddies. I don't think there's anything for me to do down there. It doesn't seem like there's anything else that could possibly be hidden here. I'm probably definitely missing a toad around here somewhere. If I had to take a guess, but oh well. Back out we go. Alright, so I'm seeing a save block over there, so that's probably our goal for this episode. Fall bridge. Danger. Jumping strictly prohibited. Alright, don't jump. Oh, uh, uh, oh, oh, another buddy. He doesn't look like this foldy guy, so that means he's friendly, right? No. Hey there, Stompy, I'm bob -omb. What's your name? Huh, he isn't saying anything, must have <laughs> I couldn't even read the rest of that dialogue. Bobby, no! Oh, I should have warned him about the paper macho enemies. Yeah, you really should have, you had plenty of time. It's all your fault, Olivia. It's all your fault. Smack. Like, you had so much time to be like, no, Bobby, stay away from that. And you were just like, nah, let's let him learn on his own. Smack. All right, buddy, come on. One more charge. Smack, smack, here we go. Hey, our uh, confetti's filled back up now, perfect. So I wonder where he fell. He kind of... well, I mean, I know where he fell, but I wonder how we get to where he fell. Would probably be a better way to say that. Come on, just a little bit more. There we go. And what do we got? Water of Elemental Shrine, Chestnut Valley. Any reason in going to Chestnut Valley? Oh, okay. Well, that answers that question. We can't go there. Looks like we can... how do we get down there? Oh, is that why it said jumping strictly prohibited? Because if I jump on this, bad things happen? Can I just... Oh. Oh, I can. 
Oh, I can. I imagine we're coming back to the Water Elemental Shrine, so I don't really mind that I missed a bit there. Bold move, Mario. Jumping off a bridge to save poor Bobby. If we survive that fall, I'm sure he did too. We're bound to bump into the little guy if we just follow the path up and out of here, right? I mean, I hope. That's what one hopes. But it's not what one can guarantee. <laughs> we may just live down here forever, Olivia, and slowly starve until I'm forced to eat you. Which I would do, because I know you would want me to. No, you wouldn't... You wouldn't want yourself to go to waste. <laughs> I don't even know where the hell I'm going with this. Okay, so treasure chest? Treasure chest. Sturdy crates. Alrighty. Got another collectible. I wonder if we get a reward for collecting all of those, or if it is just like for the prestige slash completion. Whoa, what the heck is that? Something round is rolling this way. Oh, that has to be Bobby. I didn't think we'd find him this fast. Bobby! Olivia, are you... How dense are you? Not Bobby! Not Bobby! Not Bobby! Okay, they're... Uh, what are those things called? I hate them. If you've ever been outside barefoot... Uh... In the US, I guess. I don't I don't know if they're, like, any anywhere else. Uh, these things suck walking outside barefoot. Not that I really walk outside barefoot anymore, but I did a lot as a kid, and these things suck. A lot. Really, that was nothing? Go, Mario. Peek? No. Okay, now run. Go, 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 go. Ah! Go, 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 go. I wonder if I can smack him with my hammer? Okay, cool. I did see that. Help me! Uh... How? No. Okay. I really like this remix of this particular song. Hey, you, you quit that. You stupid Goomba. No, I'm not fighting you. I just said quit it. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not that into stopping you. Oh, well, he just goes right back to it if I don't, so maybe I should. But first, I want to save Bobby. But first, I gotta go over here and make sure there's L. Okay, I didn't know that could happen. Okay, maybe we should stop the Goomba. Can we smack you? No, it doesn't do shit. Okay. Alright, now you die. I'm tired of this. Oh, whoa. Oh, yeah. I forgot. We can't just, like, one-hit them. So, I don't have to fight Goombas anymore. Alright, we gotta keep that in mind. I'm a fool. I'll openly admit it. Everyone here already knows it. If they've been watching this. Oh, hi. Didn't expect that to be a toad. Whoa, it's three. We're the chestnut trio. Thanks for conking our conker. Are you having a bad... Or is your conker having a bad fur day? Alright, so... We just gotta watch out for these things. Okay, yeah, let's drop and save you, I guess. The big M. Ma'am, you saved me. I didn't mean to fall off that bridge, honest. I said I wouldn't slow you two down, I'm so sorry. My my two best buds just saved my life. What a great memory this is gonna be. I promised I wouldn't cry. Well, um, we're just glad you're okay. You have to be more careful, Bobby. Don't go tumbling over any more bridges, all right? It's, it's just Bob on, ma'am, and I won't, I promise. I'd even pinky swear if I had a pinky, or arms, or hands. I don't even have legs. Can we hurry up out of here now? These pointy chestnut things look like they hurt. All right, out we go, Bobby. It would be pretty funny just to call him Bobby for the rest of the game, just like Olivia, but uh, no. I respect you, bob -omb. Even if your name is very boring, <laughs> because it's, it's like if my name was human. And everyone else's name was human. Oh, jeez. Okay, I think I, I fell for that the last time, too. How am I supposed to dodge that? Like, I see them coming down. I guess I just have to run back, and that's how I'm supposed to get around them? I mean, these are relatively simple, but that one gets a little funky. Alright, let's just wait. Okay, there it goes. Okay, now we run. Ugh. Okay, yeah, you just... Wow, you don't have a lot of time to clear that, actually. It's a pretty close little 
challenge. Alright, I see you hiding up there. This is a really good remix of this particular Mario song, though. I do like it. You run up the tree? Why? Just come down, you jerk. Oh, jeez. It's a Goomba stack? Um... Oh, wait, these are the chestnut Goomba things, right? I want to say I've seen these somewhere. What have I seen these from? Huh. Oh, oh well, we gotta, we gotta focus on battle right now. Um... Uh... Hmm... Uh... There's... That. No. Hmm... Um... No, that doesn't work either. I am going to fail this miserably and everyone's going to see it. And laugh at me. Uh... If I could just pull that last one down... I mean, I don't really see much reason to change it at all if I can't figure out the solution here, so I guess I'm just gonna let time run out. Mm. Yeah, I didn't see that one. I'm probably just a fool. A Galoomba, that's what they're called. Yeah, they're in one of the Mario games, I believe? If I'm thinking of the correct enemy and it's not just... in that game, Goombas just looked weird. Because I remember, yeah, you have to, like, flip them over and then stomp on their underside, and that's how you, like, defeat them. Or you just, like, throw them. Might be Mario... no. I, I don't know. I haven't played my really old Mario games in quite a while. Quite a while. I can't even remember the last time I played Super Mario World. Yeah, murder. With your massive 20 damage. You're gonna be very, very useful in a boss fight if I'm allowed to have you. Flipped over, can't move. Cool. Alright, so... How do we fix you now? I mean, we got three ring moves, but... Is that really even gonna help? Yeah, you two aren't even on the... That's not gonna work. Um, try that, I guess. And then... Uh, let's see, if I move you... No. If I move you here... Yes. And then we... Turn you guys. Right? Yes. Okay. I did it. I did it badly, but I still did it. I almost ran out of time. <laughs> Ugh. I just... I... There, some of these puzzles always just give me a hard time, but... I like to think I'm getting better, but I very, very possibly couldn't be. At least I don't do horrible on the bosses. I feel like that's the main challenge of the game. I just got 140 coins for that, and that was it. But hey, we got a ton of confetti. That's nice. And a collectible. Also nice. Spinning shells. Oh, that's the thing from the Velemental Temple. Oh, cool. I got all the collectible treasures. Thank you so much! I was a bit late on that read, but... Oh well. And smack. Alright, down we go. More chestnuts. Yikes! Super yikes! <laughs> oh, whoops. I just realized I wasn't doing his voice correctly. I was kind of in the moment, so I was a little, uh, stuck there. But, I mean, I suppose in some moments you would probably have more excited voice, but no, I'm gonna keep giving him his dumb bored one. Uh, let's see, I can move you to, you know what? Okay, let's see, if I did this, okay, yeah, no, let's just do that. No, that wouldn't work, really. Okay, I was gonna say I could move you to, like, this. And that would line you guys up. Right? But then you guys wouldn't be lined up. You and the, uh, spinies up there. Hmm... Uh... Yeah, I'm out of time and I'm not seeing it again. Now I've got to use my metal boots to kill that row. Yeah, I'm just, uh... I have a hard time with this sometimes. I hope other people do too, so I'm not the only one. I hope there's not... 
some person out there that's just like sees every single battle and immediately knows the solution, but we all have our uh, strengths and weaknesses, I guess. I don't really think I have a strength, but um, I, I have everybody has weaknesses, I, I guess is a better way to put that. So I shouldn't feel bad, right? Everybody has weaknesses, I just don't have any strengths. Boom. I can block kind of well, but the blocking feels way easier than it has in previous Paper Mario games. Um... Let's see... I mean, I guess I could just do this. And, yeah, that, that would go ahead and finish you guys off. Great lineup. And I've got a... Iron boots, you nerds. I actually need some more of these things. Oh, cool, you can do that with spinies, too. And you guys have, what was it, 12 HP? So, yeah, you're dead. I think even if I had flubbed the jump, they would have died. Hooray for watching me do uh, horrible in boss fights. I can't believe this, Big M, or Mario. Great, now he's getting me doing it. Now he's got me doing it. We can't make it more than a few feet before Bobby vanishes again. I can't tell whether Trouble's always finding him or he's seeking it out. It's true. He does vanish a lot. But hey, at least we're filling in a lot of bottomless holes. Whoa, there's a ton of these things here. Ow. Any of these gonna break open? And have a toad inside or something? I see a Galoomba hiding over there. You quit that right now, Galoomba. You quit that right now. Uh, okay. That's how you guys want to be, huh? Ow. Damn it. Free flyer, fire flower. I almost said flyer flower. Uh, coins? No, Mario, stop. Stop turning. I just want you to hit the same spot. No, keep hitting that spot. There we go. He kept, like, turning weirdly. Huh, how am I supposed to get past you guys? What does this do? Excuse me, HP. I can't jump up there, no. Oh, okay, I just gotta bring him to that side and then run across. Hello. Alright, now I just run straight by. Aha, nerds. Oh, you're a toad. <coughs> gimme, gimme. Phew, thanks a bunch, Mario. These chestnuts sure are a pain. If you're taking too many hits to your own chestnut, press Y and take a mushroom break. Thought he was about to say chestnuts, and I was gonna be like, that's lewd, Toad. That is very lewd. But no, he stopped himself. Whoop! Didn't mean to fall there. Perspective was a bit weird, so I just kinda careened off the edge like an idiot. Uh, in we go. Help me. Okay, you're stuck up there now. Gotcha. You got another uh, save point over here, Bobby? Hey, I filled in all the holes. We got that going for us, at least. Hello? It's a stump. I've seen one like you before. You were a grand sappy. Alright, well, what was... How do we get back to you? How do we even get up there? Okay, it's a pipe. We might have to go to the next screen before we can actually save him. Hmm. You look suspicious, but I can't figure anything out about it right now, so. Well, there's our save point. Just auto-saved. Okay, so we're out of Chestnut Valley. Can I get up there? No. And now we're back in Autumn Mountain. Let's drop back down here. Fill you in. Hello. Boom, boom, boom. Toads? No toads. I'm almost out of confetti, too. Hey, but a bunch of money. Okay, so how are we going to get back to Bobby? Because he, he, we needed a warp pipe to get over there, so... Where is said warp pipe? How did he even get up there? Well, I mean, he got knocked up there, I guess, but still. Oh, we're back on Autumn Mountain, but we still have to find Bobby. So did I just miss something back there? I guess I must have. 
Weird. Oh, I can't help but notice this toad over here. Wait, do you guys just die if I hit you? I don't think you're the type. I'm gonna grab this toad. Phew. Good thing I wasn't folded up on the other side of this bridge. If I was stuck in all that tall grass, you might never have found me. You'd need super sensory powers. Yeah. Yeah, I know there's toads over there. You don't have to remind me. Okay, where does this go? Like this. I mean, I'm assuming Olivia's comment means I'm probably supposed to go back to uh, that the chestnut place and there must be something else I'm missing. But also at the same time, there's this. Where does this go? Oh, it's the sensor lab? What? Um, hi. Yeah, phew. Thank you so much, Mario. I thought I'd be jammed in there forever. This is one of the Sensor Lab satellite offices located right here in Autumn Mountain. We developed advanced sensory tech to help adventurers like you. I can't offer you anything myself, but I'm sure the head researcher has something useful. You should pay him a visit. Getting to the main sensor lab is a total breeze. Let me show you some truly cutting edge tech. We developed this fax travel system to help folks zip between one of our many office locations. I'll let you zap from this satellite. It'll let you zap from the satellite office to our main sensor lab in an instant. Give it a try. What do you say, Mario? Want to fax travel? Sure. Just, just to see what this animation looks like. Yep, that's about what I expected. For sure. And there we come out, all weird. All right, sorry, had something come up. My work here is incomplete. Er, paradigm's yet unshifted, so back to it. Okay, so you didn't actually have anything new for me? Would you like to visit our satellite? Yeah. Okay. Interesting. They said uh, <clears throat> he would probably have something for me, but maybe I needed to collect more toads or something. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm missing something there. But I was pretty sure he was like, "Oh, the chief has something for you." I went there, and he just said the same thing as before. I should use the toad thing in the uh, tall grass, though. Now that I'm back over here, why not? We're right here. Uh, we might as well investigate this a little bit. Yeah, I'll screw you guys later. Okay, so tall grass toads. Let's see. And we press Y to use it? Yeah. Okay, so there's one over here. This way. Right here. Here. There we go. Wow, yeah, you're really hidden. Oh, thank goodness! Someone finally found me! Now I know how lost keys must feel. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, there's another one down here. Wow, there's like three here. There we are. Phew, I'd given up hope that I'd ever get out of here. Thanks a ton. Okay, and there's one more over here. Smack, smack, smack. There we go. Wow, how did you find me? Did you read my thoughts? Are you reading them now? Please don't. I'm thinking about Mario and his underwear, says that toad. Uh, what? There's one over here? I don't think I can get over there, though, is the problem. Yeah, it's like right there. I can't get there. I don't think. Actually, no, 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 no. That's, yeah, that's right here, isn't it? No, I can get right there. It's beeping really crazy, like, right here. So it must be, like, right there on the other side of that wall. Oh, yeah, I see it, actually. I think, yeah. I think I see it right there. All right, well, let's turn the... No. Bobby's still in Chestnut Valley. Not sure how I know that. I just do. Yup. You have secret powers. So let's just run back over here really quickly and grab this toad, I guess. Yeah, we should just drop back down here <clears throat> and walk over here. And we should be able to grab this toad. And once we get the water melt the elemental power, we'll be able to get that chest and stuff. So, oh, no you don't. Forgot how dangerous it is over here. There's enemies all over the place. No. Go, Mario, go. We must be swift. 
All right, so it was over here where it was freaking out. There's also a ton of money over here. Money, 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 money. Oh, I thought that was it. Shit. Um, well, let's turn it back on. Oh, is it this? Oh, yeah, it's a leaf under the pile of leaves. Okay, cool. You saved me. There we go. All right, are there any more toads hiding around here? That I may have missed? Okay, it seems to think there's one right up there. It's not really getting any more, though. I remember when I said I probably wasn't going to use this because it was going to make the toad finding too easy, basically. Or may I think I was talking about a badge, actually. But, uh, yeah, I've changed my tune on that because a lot of these toads are extremely well hidden and seem to even require this thing. So, <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to be using it. As uh, the game seems to want me to. All right, now we just have to go back all the way over here. Actually, I think we're probably going to go ahead and end this episode off here now that I think about it, because uh, I have some things to do and I'm running out of time here. So, yeah, before we get into anything else, I think it'd probably be best just to go ahead and end it off here, because I would have to end it off soon anyway. And there's a convenient save point right here. So, next time on uh, Paper Mario the Origami King, we'll find Bobby. I hope you've enjoyed this episode, and I will see you next time.